है वी हैव ऑब्जर्व दैट इन स्कूल्स प्रैक्टिकल्स आर डन एट द एंड द स्टूडेंट्स मेक लैब मैनुअल्स एट द एंड दिस इज वन ऑब्जर्वेशन सेकेंड ऑब्जर्वेशन इज द लैब्स आर ओनली फॉर इलेवेंथ एंड ट्वेल्थ क्लास Ninth and tenth class sometimes use, and sixth to eighth class never use. For that lab, science lab manuals and science laboratories needs to be reviewed practically every week, as per the principal's handbook. When the principal starts, it says you have to review. Then you have to review the lab. Let us understand how can we review. What are the review points? and how can we make our lab laboratories better for carrying out experiment in the laboratory students first needs need to know about the proper use of the laboratory equipments the lab manual familiarize the students with the available instruments in the laboratory and that must start from class 6 itself in the class 6 itself do's and don'ts of lab must also be explained that while performing experiment these are the do's and don'ts and at the beginning of the session only this all labs must start it must start so at the time of first review as per principles handbook and principles starts grade in the first week of april first you have to start the review and what all to review that all students have made the lab manual when the attendance register market and have a report of it that all the students have made lab manuals second is check on the syllabus and the practical classes allocation in the time table what happens is that we don't allocate the practical classes in the time table so you need to immediately when the review day comes first week check whether the practical uh, practical periods are allocated or not check on the syllabus in the reference link of this video i have provided a lot of reference reference links of the experiments which are supposed to be done class wise so you can refer to the references and see what are the practicals which are supposed to be done i am sure you might be having a list but if you don't have a list these references can help you out then as per the syllabus you need to check whether those experiments are been conducted or not or practical periods and practicals are neglected by the teacher and left for end of the year that right now we have a rush to complete the syllabus so don't do practicals no practical need to be done and they need to start from the very first week of when the session starts they need to be taken on a very serious note then apron and eyewear in chem chemistry lab you need to review whether the students when they enter the chemistry lab are they wearing apron because sometimes on their dress some chemical might fall down and are they wearing the eyes glasses because acid also they are going to be facing with so 6 to 12 it is mandatory mind it not only for 9th 10th or 11th 12th just for board examinations no 6 to 12th lab for everyone yes it is mandatory many schools don't even create laboratories for 6 to 8 class students you have to do it and this can be the usp of your school they starting from 6 class we send our students to laboratories they understand science they will start loving science they will never hate science if they are doing experiments over there in laboratories and this is why we have taken this point on a very serious note in principles review then maintaining of the lab manuals i am sure you might be knowing i'm just sharing some tips organization content accuracy table of content is up to the date page numbers page are numbered indexes maintained no pages skipped illustrations and diagrams are very clear and accurate and students are bringing lab manuals understanding the science concept i am sure that you might be knowing all these points so the lab manuals of every class must reach to the principal's table and principal need to check on all these points you can depute someone that is okay but sometimes you need to also pick up and check 
and if you check on the very first week or on a regular basis then every student is going to be very serious as a principal if you do it then every student will be serious then you have to check the cleanliness of the labs you have to check the stocks of the lab laboratories whether the stock is proper or not i have given a link over the here where you will you don't need to purchase from there but you will you can get to know what are the lab equipments which you require in every lab so there you can get the list of laboratory equipments from this particular link in the reference then you need to regularly train your lab in charges educate supplies are there now the training must be there so again this is a review point whether your lab in charges know those experiments which are supposed to be conducted from 6 to 12th or are they not even aware of it or teachers if the teacher they taking lab classes then they have to be trained the training of the teachers there are a lot of softwares and websites those who are doing online labs even lockdown physical laboratories are not there then simulation of these laboratories are there available today online or with the help of some softwares you can do that cpd online.in has got all the experiments conducted over there so you can the students can watch those experiments at least apart from physics chemistry and biology lab science lab uh, social science lab and mathematics lab and geography labs uh, are very important computer laboratories are very important in computer laboratories whether the server is there where internet connection is there where good speed is there there or not where a lot of softwares are there all the curriculum mapped softwares are there inside the computers or not you need to check you need to review on the in the very first week mouses are working or not equipment is working or not displays are fine so laboratories have to be checked laboratory manuals have to be checked manuals have to come to the principal in the very first week and you need to check that the experiments are been conducted i am sure you might have found this video useful if you have found this useful please do subscribe to subscribe the youtube channel to get more interesting videos do follow principal's handbook and diary principal stars grid is going to remind you again and again about these interesting videos and what you need to do as a principal Thank you very much.